how to use dropship.io. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can get started with Dropship.io. Now Dropship.io is one of the world's largest platform to find winning products to sell for dropshipping. As dropshipping has become more popular, it's become a very competitive market to find products that are going to sell well. So finding the best product is going to be one of your primary objectives whenever you're starting dropshipping, and Dropship.io can simplify this process a lot. Not only that, but Dropship.io is integratable with Shopify, Amazon, eBay, WooCommerce, BigCommerce, and other large retail platforms. So let's get started. Now to get started, simply click on start free trial over here. Once you click on start free trial, you can get started with your Google, Apple, or your email address. So I'm going to sign up using my email uh, on Google because I just want to simplify the sign up process and I'm going to use my Google account to complete my sign up. And from here, we're going to choose which plan we want. So we're gonna get a seven day free trial and I'm gonna opt for their basic plan which allows 20 searches per day and has, you know, details about the different features. After that, I'm just going to complete my information over here. So now that we have completed our basic signup, we can proceed. From here, click on go to dashboard. And once you do that, you're going to choose how you want to proceed with Dropship.io. So if you have a Shopify store, you can connect that. If you don't have one and you want to generate your store by yourself, you can do that. Or you can use AI to generate a pre-built store. I have a Shopify store, so I'm going to click on continue over here and we're going to connect our Shopify store. So over here, this will open up the Shopify app store and I have already logged on to Shopify on the same browser. So it's directly linking to my account and I'm just going to click on install over here. Once I click on install over here, a new tab is going to open up, which is going to complete my installation to integrate Dropship.io into Shopify. Once I've done that, I can proceed with my product search. So I'm just going to go into my Dropship.io dashboard and now we can get started. On the top left, you're going to find a menu bar and in this, you're going to have your dashboard. Then you have your ad library, which means any ads that are being run for products that are giving good results that are having a winning result you guys can see the spent the reach and the region for these you also have ad spots so you can view the engagement of facebook ads then you also have their product database which is one of the primary features most people are using you guys can see that we have 20 searches per day we can upgrade to their unlimited plan for more and below that, you guys can see different links, prices, monthly sales, and monthly revenue for each one of these products. Below that, we also have a sales tracker, which allows us to track sales of a certain product. This basically allows you to assess a product's performance before you integrate it into your store. For example, I want to integrate a puppy feeder, okay? What I would do is I would sales track multiple different types of puppy feeders and then over a period of time i would see which one is performing better then i would take that product and have it be added in or included in my store you can take a look at some of the top stores and top products as well then you have competitor research where you can see other stores that are performing well that are in the same niche as you then you have your own portfolio and your own collections and then you have their dropship university and suppliers so from here we're gonna go on to their product database once we go into their product base over here we're going to get started with searching for products now i want to search for lip oil let's say and once i do that i can wait for some of the well-performing products and you can even apply filters you even have presets you can load a preset as well we're going to wait for our search to be completed now you guys can see there are several different links, the prices, monthly sales, and monthly revenue. This one, this lip oil trio is $75, monthly sales are $21, and $1,500 in revenue. Then if I scroll down, this one has $1,300 in revenue. Now I might want to focus more so on higher revenue, so I'm going to click on over here. 
And we even have a Google extension available for Dropship IO, which can help us in doing real-time product research. So if you're browsing on AliExpress or Alibaba, you're able to see whether or not you can import these products. Now, taking a look at monthly sales, this one is a pretty good one. They have the P. Louise Energy one. This one has a great monthly revenue and it's only $29. So I'm going to click on this product and we have their selling price as well. Then we have their example orders. So let's say I get a thousand orders and the selling price that I'm going to give is going to be around eight dollars okay we have a 60 percent profit margin the estimated cpa estimated fees per order shipping cost cost of goods sold and we can see our potential profit as well you guys can see they have a hundred images and then 95 variants available and i think this is a pretty decent product so i'm going to click on over here and i can import this directly into shopify by clicking on import to shopify or i can start tracking this product as well to see the product's performance over a certain period of time to see if this is going to perform well in the future on my store as well so i'm going to directly import to shopify store click on import like so once i click on import over here this is going to start taking this product and product info onto my shopify store and i'm just going to wait for the sync to be completed once you have this completed you can visit their imported products page and i'm going to just see this is what the draft of this product looks like so here are all the different variants there are over 95 variants now I personally think these are too many variants, so I would actually go on ahead and remove a couple of these because 97 is just way too much for it to look realistic. So I am going to remove a couple of these and, you know, you can go with any ones you want to remove. I'm just removing them randomly because I just don't want these many variants. You can even go into bulk edit to edit this and I'm just going to do this and I'm going to review the images and remove the images of the variants we're not selling. Then you have your description. So we're going to remove this. We have a pretty decent description, but I could go into their AI tool to further make our description more extended or rephrased and I can rephrase this into sophisticated or playful and I'm going to click on generate again and I want it to be in a you know playful tone just like this after that I would scroll down and I can see my price and this price is way too less so I would actually go on ahead and you know put my markup on this and then click on save once I click on save I can then publish this product simply by going back and once we do that i could just click on over here click on the status click on more actions and then click on publish so just like that you can get started with dropship io and the best part is is that their basic plan at 39 dollars includes 20 searches per day with product database and competitor research as well as 10,000 credits in ad spot as well as 10,000 credits in ad libraries and you can attract 20 products per week in your portfolio with 10 stores 20 products and 15 stores per day tracked on your chrome extension I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe and if you have any questions or queries you can leave those in the comment box down below. I would love to know what you guys have to say.